just survive Or am I foolish in Wasting my time Try so hard to quiet my Why don't you just call her? Expensive dreams Before they take me out Just um missing someone, that's all. Hey. What do you got there? Can you read me a story? I think that's an excellent idea. Come on. You know, this will probably make me feel better. Oh, Christina, I love this book. I used to go to the library a couple years ago and read it all the time when I was hoping to have a little girl of my own. You know what my favorite part is? I like when the prince rides in on his big white horse to save the princess. And then the, the prince tells the princess that he loves her. Yeah, you know that, huh? And then the princess kisses him and says that she has loved him all along. And then they ride off into the big white clouds on their big white horse. All because, what? The prince wanted to rescue her. But you know what? That doesn't only happen in fairy tales, Christina. Doesn't look like anybody lives here. Have you even had a meal in this apartment since Sam got shot? Do you sleep here? I don't sleep much lately. Because when you reach for her, she isn't there. I can remember the feeling when I thought Lucky was gone. It's just easier to stay awake. But I didn't have a choice. You do. Sam loves you. She wants to be a part uh, of your Elizabeth, life, Elizabeth, you, you didn't come here to talk about Sam. Maybe I am. Um, I probably shouldn't be here. Why are, why are you here? I feel like a hypocrite. I know I told you I, I didn't want you to help with the situation with Lucky and... Now he's gone back to work and he's pushing himself too hard and he's in a lot of pain and he doesn't want Mac to know because he's afraid he's going to get put back on disability. And... How can I help you? There was a time in my life when Lucky gave me back my self-confidence. I want to do that for him now. He still blames himself for Jesse's death. That wasn't that wasn't his fault. I know, I know, and everyone keeps telling him that, but he doesn't want to hear it, and it makes it even worse that he wasn't able to save me from Manny. But he did risk his life for you that night. But it wasn't enough. Because the truth is, if you hadn't shown up, Lucky and I would probably both be dead. And in a lot of ways, Lucky is still flat on his back on that pier in a lot of pain, helpless. I just want to give him back his confidence. I want him to be able to feel good about himself again. I'm still not sure what you're asking me. What if... What if Lucky could solve a crime that nobody else could figure out? Or what if he could arrest a major criminal? I don't want Lucky to arrest you. I was thinking maybe there might be somebody out there that you wouldn't mind having arrested. Maybe someone you, you want to get a message to or, or get out of the way. And not as in disappear, but as in just go to jail. And not a homicidal maniac like Manny. Just a regular bad dude. <laughs> just a regular bad dude. Is that a, a problem? I, I, are you laughing? Well, you know, it really sounds kind of sounds funny. <sighs> the regular bad dude. I don't really know. Look, what... I never said I was any good at this. I just want Lucky to do something that he can be proud of. 
It has to be something kind of significant, but obviously not, not anything dangerous because I don't want him getting hurt again. Do you think you can arrange something like that? Maybe. But are you sure you're being fair to Lucky? When Lucky and I were teenagers, we used to run away from home and we'd sleep under the docks. We were so close and so connected. And I knew then that we would always be together. And then last night, I was on the docks, taking a break, not wanting to go home. And there was Lucky. He had created quite a scene at my work earlier, accusing me of not such nice things. He still thinks there's something going on with Patrick? That's crazy. I thought for a second that he was going to apologize. But he didn't. And we just went home. I haven't felt that alone in a really long time. I just want my husband back. And not this angry, suspicious stranger who thinks everything I do is wrong. If Lucky can make this bust, then maybe... Maybe he'll stop punishing himself. Maybe he'll let go of his anger. And he'll see how capable he really is. I can't guarantee that that's going to happen. I won't do anything to help my husband. Will you help me?